I am going to show you why it is very necessary to contour faces with dodging and burning tools, such as the actions we have in our Color Bill Everyday Clean set. This dodge and burn is not exactly like the dodging and burning that you have in your tools, and it's also easier to use um, and adjust accordingly. You don't have to um, make background copies of backgrounds before you use it. So I ran both of the tools, dodge and burn, and I just want to show you uh, the difference of why you would like to dodge areas of the face. Dodging, bringing light back into the face, gives a contour to the areas where the sun hit it or should have hit it. So what we did is we took this paint on Dodge and we painted the areas that the sun would most naturally hit. High on the upper uh, forehead near the brow bone, a thin line down the nose, um, a, a swoop underneath each of the eyes and also a smaller definition in the inner corners of the eye. Also, the sun is um, running down the side of her, so we also followed that a little along the neck and down the front of the arm. Again, this is a contouring type of effect. By doing this, you're allowing multiple shades on somebody's face, which really brings back in the definition that can be lost. In the same respect, we've also done that with the burn tool. And we've come through and we've just used this burn tool a little bit to bring back the shadowing that we would need. Not shadows such as things making a shadow on a face, but shadows of a face, the contour, the creasing, the brow bone, um, under the eyes, really allowing it to not be flat anymore. So I wanted to show you why this is necessary um, to use. So I am going to group the two together, the dodge and the burn, and hide them. And this is a great photo and it absolutely is, is perfect without it. But when you add that little bit, you're bringing more awareness and definition to her face. Now once you have painted these on, then you can definitely just turn them down a little bit to naturally get um, a balance between burning and dodging in the original photograph. So again, this doesn't change anything other than the background. It just kind of contours all the pieces of the face um, to help you. I'm going to show you where we painted them on. So this is the dodge. All of the white areas are where we painted. Again, under the brow bone, around the eyes, down the nose, um, a little bit on the lips just to catch some light down her neck and around her shoulder. Here are the places that we burned hers. We On this photograph, all we needed to do was burn over the eyebrows, under the eye, um, right where the lower lash line would be, not actually under the eye where the dark spots may be. Sometimes you may wish to burn just the it very inner lip. And that makes a nice definition, too. So thank you so much for watching.